What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Preston here, also known as Tech Gun Sports Lover. I appreciate you guys joining me for another video. Today we're going to take a look at two different knives. Both of these are made by Dax Industries. That's D-A-X Industries. Down below in the description of this video, I'll include information um, to that company and also where you can pick these up uh, on Amazon. So the first knife we'll talk about is this knife right here they don't have any formal type names this is a uh, fixed blade obviously branded as an outdoor hunting or survival type knife now the blade length is seven inches as you can see it has a really unique design you've got 420 stainless steel You got a high friction grip, which, which makes it fairly easy to hold and maintain in your hand. Now this is essentially a rubberized grip, but again, it works out pretty well. It does come with a nylon sheath. As you can see, nothing special on this sheath in fact i think they could have done a lot better with this sheath so you're going to probably want to get a different sheath if you do purchase the knife you got a blade thickness of three millimeters and overall length of 12 inches and you got a weight of nine ounces this does come with a limited lifetime manufacturer's warranty also on the back here, you do have sort of a defensive tool or a glass breaker. At the top of the blade, this can also be used as a saw. It is fairly sharp. So those are the specs of the, the first knife. Um, like I said, you're getting 420 stainless steel. I've done some initial testing with this knife. Um, it is pretty good. Uh, cuts fairly well. Easy to maintain, easy to keep a uh, a good edge on the blade. Now, when we're done talking about these two knives, I'm going to go outside and we'll do some, some tests and show you guys exactly how these stack up. So here's the second knife. Now, this is branded as a survival knife. This comes with a magnesium alloy fire starter with a lanyard. Let me show you that really quick right here and that is inside the sheath there's that and the same thing the sheath is is okay it's better than having nothing but you're going to want to probably get a uh, different sheath if you uh if you do buy this and it's it's the same as the other sheath is nylon so the addition of the little rod here the fire starting rod is, is a definite plus, especially given the price point. And we'll talk about price point here in a second. So this is full tang. You got an overall length of eight inches. The steel on this one is 3CR13. Of course, that is stainless steel, Chinese variant. Not the best steel, but it's not the worst either. You got a blade thickness of four millimeters. And you're really able to get a good grip on this knife. You got a nice little finger guard right here. Got a fair amount of, I guess you would consider this jimping. But it fits really good in the hand. Your finger's not going to slip because of this little finger guard here. Of course, the handle is wrapped in a uh, paracord. That orange paracord makes this knife really visible. And you also got some right at the end here where, there, where this lanyard hole is located. And those are the specs of these two knives. Let's talk about this point really quick. The larger of the two is $19.99. 
the smaller is $14.99. I think that's a really good price point for what you're getting. Um, as I said, I've tested these for the last week. They seem to perform pretty good, but I want you to see for yourself. We'll go outside and conduct some tests, and I'll come back and uh, wrap the video up. Follow me. All right guys, so quick conclusion. These are definitely some quality knives here. Again, these are from Dax Industries. I put these knives through the ringer for the past week. I've cut rope, I've cut through trees, I've cut paper boxes, and they've uh, held up pretty nicely. As you can see, they're pretty dirty right now. They need to be sharpened. But again, these are definitely worth the money at $20 for this one and at about $15 for this one. These are some knives you want to take a look at. I want to thank the guys at Dax Industries for sending both of these knives out to me. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. We'll talk to you soon.